Hello everyone, and welcome back to City Skylines. This is the 12th episode, and today, I don't know what to do, so I think we're just gonna do like a, a tour of what we've done this time. First of all, there's the, the, the town. And this building, the little town, there's downtown, and you can see some of the skyscrapers even from here. This bit is the island where we've got some houses in here as well and plenty of them I don't think that many people live here let's see let's see how many people live here the optimal way to check is to make a district 72 people live here High land values, too. And this is all seniors. Everyone living here is a senior. This one has a young adult in it, though. But there's an awful lot of seniors. No wonder my population's constantly in the negative. Because there's so many seniors dying. And also vanishing. And how many people does the town have? That part we also need to find out. It has... 2,526 people. So what should we rename it to? I think we should call it... Town City. I'm a I'm a comedy genius. Here's the city zoo, which has a bunch of different enclosures. And yes, I renamed that to aquatic animal enclosure because I felt it fit better with the non, not very serious theme of, not very serious vibe of my city. This interchange isn't very good. Probably. I don't actually know how to measure efficiency of interchanges. Here's the neighborhood I built specifically for the zoo. That I should, that I forgot to expand. That I forgot to expand the size of. Put all the houses over here, inside of the district. And upgrade. To turn all these houses into the proper... Into the proper for the spot, for the area, look. Oh boy, it's lagging. Oh, and that house is a br- Aww. 
I like that color. That was a neat color. Now I'm searching for houses that don't belong. Any stragglers that aren't the right size and thus don't belong. And also destroying a few other houses so that the correct houses can spawn in instead. Oh dang it, I destroyed the road. There. All fixed. Those houses shouldn't be there. They're too duplexy. Alright, the Zoo Heights is now fixed. Here's the Aspen District. And its shopping center. The Aspen District Shopping Center, which has its own monorail station. Here's the other side of the Aspen District, which wraps around the neighborhood. Here are these. Here are my geothermal heating plants. There's my biofuel bus depot, and there's my tra tram depot that only serves this area anymore. With its Linden Park Chestnut District. I want to enable theme management, put on American Eclectic. Linden Park, enable theme management, and put on University City. Meaning. But now, I have to destroy literally every building. Everything. All of it. Whoa, whoops. Too far. I went too far with it. I went too far with the destroying of buildings. Because I destroyed a few in the next neighborhood over. Well, I guess it's time to bring out the trusty old Move It mod. To fix the neighborhood better. Uh, uh. Delete. There we go. All the neighborhood houses are destroyed now. Gotta remove those two. Uh, gotta remove that too. Remove those. Bye bye. And that. And this one. Chestnut District here. I set to American Eclectic. So. We have some more work to do. Maybe change, fix the rotation. And demo all the buildings. So that so that it can fix itself. And the Myrtle District is another unfortunate case. Alright, it is already set to American Eclectic. Well, maybe no, maybe not upgrade. Maybe instead, delete all of them and delete those two. So that way they rebuild in their proper form. American Eclectic Design.
The Myrtle District is quickly restructuring itself as well. So I think what we should do, I'm thinking Hold on, hold on game. Woohoo, no, 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 bad game. Okie doke, now and do that and that. There. Now there's an exit going to the university. Once Myrtle District finish it fills in everything, upgrade and then upgrade again. Then then there's the main part of town. Tons of tall buildings and a more complex monorail system than the rest of than anywhere else in town and a ferry system to town city. I wasn't run I was wondering why it wasn't working before, but then I realized it was because I forgot to put a line. But I've got that all situ situated now, though. So I think that's going to be all for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, be sure to leave a like. And also, if you really enjoyed it, be sure to subscribe and leave a comment to say to leave some feedback with a comment. It would be much appreciated. And I think I'll see you guys next time.